Now the On Your Side forecast with Chief Meteorologist Scott Dorval. Our weather has definitely cooled down during the day today. Look at this, 50s in the mountains and only 60s in the Treasure Valley. A good 10 degree cooling, in fact, more than 10 degrees. 14 degrees cooler now than it was yesterday at this time, up at around 79. We're at 65 right now. A lot of cloud cover in the Treasure Valley. Had a few sprinkles in the Meridian area this morning and parts of the Treasure Valley, but not too much has been going on. And you see across the region, there's still some rain falling down to the south. Mountain home, you're getting some light showers here. These are tracking slowly to the north barely holding together, but later this evening there's a chance for some rain to come into the Treasure Valley favoring the east of Boise. Uh, in Canyon County may stay dry for a while, but there's a shower here as well. So we have a slight chance overnight tonight, uh, this evening I should say, and then later tonight you'll see this moisture moving into Grand, uh, Glens Ferry, so it is raining here, and Mountain Homes got those sprinklers near, uh, nearby, but this rain tracking to the north could make it to Boise later this evening. It's tomorrow, another chance for some showers coming in as more energy starts to come in from the south. We have that slight chance of showers continuing not a rainy day. Certainly today was not a rainy day, although we have some threatening skies out there. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy uh, with the chance of some showers in the morning. It doesn't look like a huge chance. During the afternoon, we get some sunshine mixing in, but that could bubble up a shower or a thunderstorm later in the day as well. Eventually, this low pressure and this dip in the cool air will slide to the east. Now, we'll keep a northwesterly breeze over the weekend. That's going to keep us on the cool side, but I think we'll dry out in the Treasure Valley as we move through the weekend as well. Here's the future cast to tomorrow morning. These charts show just cloudy skies over Boise, so we'll watch for the threat for a shower in the Magic Valley. You've got a good chance of some showers more tonight and more tomorrow. Less of a threat towards the Treasure Valley. Tomorrow afternoon, Friday, we may dry out with some sun trying to show up with mountain showers. So a threatening evening, but again, if you've got a ball game plan, I wouldn't cancel it just yet because it may end up being dry at that time of day with a chance for a shower during the day. It's tough to nail down the timing on that at all. Early Saturday morning now, this is after midnight, just mostly cloudy skies. And then drier weather comes in for Saturday afternoon. I think we have plenty of sunshine. Some of this rain here could move in Saturday night just to the south, but I still think we'll get some sunshine on Sunday as well. But the breeze is going to pick up as well. So we have a cool weekend in store, that's for sure. Tomorrow, just those hit or miss showers and maybe a storm unsettled on Friday. And remaining cool over the weekend, but the showers push to the east. We just keep the cool weather and breezy conditions around. But I think it'll be an open Okay, weekend. If you, it just won't be like it was last weekend in the mid 90s. So 74 in Ontario tomorrow. The chance for a shower, certainly not a washout. A lot of clouds like today. Northwest breeze, maybe 10 to 15. And those temperatures might get up to 70 degrees for a high tomorrow. The West Central Mountains, a few showers are likely. Maybe a shower Saturday and partly cloudy with just a stray mountain shower on Sunday. So a dry process through the weekend in the Central Mountains, mid 50s. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, 20 degrees cooler than it was last weekend. The magic. Valley tomorrow. Tonight you have some showers around. Tomorrow mostly cloudy with scattered showers. Temperatures in the 60s. Again, I think more showers in the Magic Valley than in the Treasure Valley. Here's my on your side extended forecast into the weekend. I'm still thinking near 70 Saturday, more breezy and cooler on Sunday with mid 60s and some nice weather coming in for Monday and Tuesday with temperatures shooting back up into the 70s and then another cool down after that. Look at next Wednesday, 62 and windy. Hmm. Ooh, that's a little bit of a chill there. So this is a cooler weather pattern. Long range outlook for June, above normal temperatures mm. and dry conditions. Really? Good for outdoors, but not the best of news for moisture. And yeah. fire so, season. And fire season, exactly. Okay. Start early. Mm. Thanks, All right, Scott. Thanks, Scott. Coming up.